Hi, my name is Marco, and today I'm going to uh, show you how to use Splunk's Postman for Splunk App Inspect. So Postman makes it easy to communicate with Splunk's API, um, App Inspect API. And you might be using Splunk's App Inspect um, if you're trying to publish your app on Splunk base and you want that check mark that says it's been Splunk App Inspect approved. So um, in order to start using Postman, you need to go onto uh, dev.splunk.com and download the Postman JSON. And I'll link this in the description below. So just open this guy, open link a new tab, and we're going to save him. Do a save as. And so just save it. Then you're going to log on to your Postman um, session. Um, if you don't have one, you'll have to create one. All you need is an email. That's pretty much it. And from here, you could click on the import tab and upload files and upload that JSON that you just uh, saved. So here it goes, open, import. So now we have it uh, working here. So the first thing you wanna do is you want to get authenticated. So you click on the authenticate tab. You click here to, I believe it's potty. Let me full screen this for you. Yeah, you go to the authorization and all you have to do here is input your um, Splunk credentials. And then you send it. Uh, from here, you'll get a token saying that everything was successful and um, followed by your name. And the next step is to submit your actual application. That you so to do this, you go here to the body and you select your Splunk app. And this can be either a .spl or a .tar. Doesn't really matter. Here's mine. And then you send it. From here, you'll get um, the status. And you can also go to the following tab to get a status again. So you can see that everything was successful. So now if we want to view the actual report, we click here on the HTML tab. Then you send it again. Then you can, then this is the JSON that it responds with. You can read this or you can go to the preview tab and it is all there. So you can see here, this is the name of my app. And student performs, it's a student performance in exams. So um, description of my app, the author, that's me. And then it'll give you results. So in this case, this app uh, has nine failures, uh, 152 checks that aren't applicable and 163 checks that um, were successful. So from here you can, um, it tells you what's wrong with your app. In my case, I'm missing the app.com fi uh, file, and I'm also I also have some Nix permissions. Um, but from here, you can just t package and retest. So this is how you use Blunk's App Inspect API with Postman. Thank you.